Okay, here we are at the Colonnades. Um, I've just finished my breakfast meal, which is which was quite nice. Um, and now I am on my way back to where I live. So let's try not to run any crows over. Yes, I fed some. Wow, just felt like they needed something nice, I suppose. The line for Costa drive through is ridiculous. So up and over. My phone is shaking like mad, but it'll be alright. Ooh, up to speed. I don't know if you can see it on the recording, but the, um, phone is shaking quite a lot in its holder, so a bit odd, but it's just, that's just the way it is. I'm not going to bother singing because then YouTube will copyright me. Um, but yeah. Sometimes you have to hold these things. I think the suspension should be good enough, but just in case. this uh, street sweeper because a van cut me up. Now well. One heck of a small vehicle, isn't it? It's actually quite weird because <clears throat> when the leaves fall off the trees when it comes to autumn and winter, as you guys know, um, some people use leaf blowers to blow it onto the road. The street sweepers then sweep it up. I'm not sure where it goes after that. Maybe it's for a tree farm? I don't know around this guy hopefully nice and gently nice and gentle to a stop there we go and gently around this bus. <clears throat> Alright, that nearly took my car out, but... Gently as we go, nothing's gonna stop me now. While I can't sit in a yellow box, I can't let other cars bully me, unfortunately. Because if they bully me, then it means that they own that particular part of the road, which they don't. So, Like I said before, this is pearly, or well, the outskirts are pearly now. I normally go right here, I might not this time. Nah, not this time. But, um, 
normally I go right just before the the, the petrol station there. Um, who knows? I might end up being a taxi one day at this rate. Oh, hello. No, 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 no. No, mate. Just because you got a Skoda does not mean I can I can automatically break the rules of the road because I just won't. Okay, this is interesting. A cyclist and a motorbike coming the other way. Alright. This is interesting because I can't get around this motorbike this cyclist. It looks like he might have a child on the back. No. Put EV mode on until I can be sure I can get past him. Can't get past him at the moment. There we go, there's a chance, but no. Better not. Hmm. It's better to be safe than sorry. Thank you for not knocking into me, guys. As you guys might have seen there, I had um, a bit, not very many opportunities to overtake the cyclist. But, you know, the dangerous thing is, he's allowed on the road, as am I. And normally they say, you know, cars have, um, a, not a right, but there's more cars on the road than bikes, it seems. I could be wrong. I could be talking about the claptrap, but... Yeah. Alright, let's get a bit quicker. <laughs> ah. Yeah, it's a fairly quick trip to go to the colonnades and back. And that's why I like it, because it's it's not too far away. It's not too far coming back either. Bus. Big red thing is a bus. The sun's coming out. Did really? Nah, it's fine. Time Travellers Travelling Diaries or something. Not diaries, that's a bit naff, but I might call it Time Travellers Journey, I guess. Journeys? Maybe? Journeys? Eh, maybe. You might hear me opening a drink in a minute because, well, a fizzy drink, not a alcoholic one. Because I'm not allowed alcohol when I'm driving. And certainly not at 7.34 in the morning. Yeah. I like the taste of iron brew. This stuff. 
I would show you the actual bottle, but where the phone's positioned, it's kind of squashed against the windscreen. Excuse me. Mm. Excuse me again. but didn't have a choice there. Oh dear. Looks like I was stuck in a traffic jam. Whoa. I can't exactly reverse, buddy. Got an, a fucking... Whoops. Sorry to swear there. I've got a, uh, a van behind me. Didn't mean to swear, I do apologise. Swearing is the lowest form of wit, so... I don't like swearing if I can help it. Some people you just think to yourself, how did you get your license? You know what I mean? Some people you think, yeah, yeah, you got a license, you know, and all that stuff. But some people you think, are you even driving with a license? You know what I mean? Because quite a lot of people will drive a car, they'll just hop in, get in, drive it from point A to point B, get out, and that'll be the end of it. But some people just take cars and steal them. It's like, what is the point in that? Don't get me wrong, when I was um, like 15 or so, I used to want to have like a sporty Subaru, which to, for those of you who don't know, I might be able to put a picture on, but if I don't, then um, uh, please forgive me. It's basically a blue sports uh, rally car, I would say sports car, but it's more of a rally car. Um, <clears throat> now, the more modern ones look like a Ford Focus, so I don't really like them. I like the ones from 2007 and previous to that. Um, so, you know, further down the scale, like 2006, 2005, 2004. Um, I had a 1999 Subaru at one point. It was nice, don't get me wrong, but it needed a brand new radiator. 
and to cut a very very long story short which one day I'll in tell yourselves but for now all I'll say is it was just a nightmare from the from the um, first few weeks onwards not just the fact that it would cost a lot of money but the fact that people kept saying to me oh I don't think you can afford this and all that sort of stuff all while straight in my face you know so all in all pretty annoying because if someone wants to say to you right you can afford X that's fine you know but when you get over a certain age you're like what's it got to do with you just because I can afford this doesn't mean I have nice things it just means I'm spending my money poorly you know so for example you know I could have a Porsche or an Audi or something but that doesn't mean I've got a lot of money it just means I spend my money unwisely you know whereas if I've got a Corsa or a Persia like the one that's trying to drive me around the bend from behind and you know who knows you know I've had a BMW before but not like the one ahead um, I've had one that was a 2004 2005 plate um, it was a 316i and all it really needed was new wiper blades and the fuel um, area sorting which I got sorted in the end but um, yeah anyway that's the end of this video I hope you enjoyed it if you like please like comment subscribe and all that lovely stuff if you want you don't have to it's not a requirement but it would be nice if you did and uh, yeah I'll see you guys later on and um, I won't be able to do this all the time I'm only doing this as I'm parked up but I know this is the uh, guy who you've been hearing all this time um, time traveler it, well I do have an actual name but I don't want to give that out just yet anyway catch you later guys bye